I am Sarah Kovac, and this video is going to be a little different from the other ones you may have seen. Usually I'm uploading a video of how I do things and the unique way that my life is, and I wanted to take a minute to let you get to know me as a person and see what's b behind all the interesting, fun little things that I do. I'm a wife and a mother. I have a three-year-old son, and we have another child on the way due in August. I have been doing some speaking since uh, three years ago. We appeared on CNN, and they featured my story, and people have been asking me to speak and, and share with different organizations since then, and I love that because there's been a lot of pain that I've endured, just like everybody else, but I feel that because I'm overcoming things or working around things or dealing with things physically that maybe people feel like they can deal with the things that aren't physical that I can encourage them to deal with the things that not everybody can see but because everybody can see what I'm dealing with then I don't know I just think it makes people feel brave and <laughs> there are plenty of sides of me that are not noble and are not worthy of praise and and I don't deny that I am not a hero I am not there are so many parts of me that are not inspirational but if somebody can pluck meaning from some part of me that maybe is then I'm just going to be happy and say thank God <laughs> because it's wonderful to see your pain used for good in somebody else I just finished a book that will be released in September of this year, but it, it's available for pre-order now on Amazon and Barnes and & Noble. So if you want to go search my name, you can find it and pre-order it. But I think what you'll find in there is that we have a lot more in common than we do things that separate us. We all struggle with the same things, you know. It's, it's always, there's, there's nothing that I can go through that isn't common to other people. Uh, it just might look different as I'm going through it. And, you know, we've all struggled with public perception and feeling like we're not enough and, and you know, wanting to be perfect. And, and those are themes in my book. And I think I've, I've, began, I've begun to scratch the surface of healthy ways to deal with all that. In a nutshell, I think that it's perfectly fine that I have flaws and it's perfectly fine that I'm not perfect and it's perfectly fine that I can't always be the mother I want to be to my children because I'm surrounded by a community of people and I'm in the arms of a loving God and he'll be what I need when I can't be it. I hope to keep speaking forever. I love it. I hope to keep writing forever. I hope that in a few years my husband can quit his job and just manage my career. We would love that and I hope to travel. These are dreams of mine, but everything that's happened that's been good so far to this point has sort of just fallen in my lap. So I'm not going to push it. I'm not going to try to make things happen because I think there are things that are meant to be and those things will be. So it's been so great to meet you and I look forward to sharing my pregnancy journey with you as we go. And I'd love to hear your story, so leave me a comment or find me on Facebook or Twitter or whatever. I'm on every social network there is, but look me up. I'd like to get to know you. Thanks.